This is a video about a product called Plasti Dip. You can get it in a spray can like this. This is the black. What I'm going to show you today is how you can spray your emblem on your vehicle. For instance, SR5 V6 on my Toyota 4Runner with the Plasti Dip to give it a black color. And if you don't like it, you can peel it right off because it's a plastic based covering that you can use for your tools and whatnot. You got it at Home Depot. It's like six bucks a can. For small jobs like this, all you need is one can, um, some painter's tape, some cleaner. I use this electrical cleaner. You can use any alcohol based cleaner you like. You want to get the area real clean and a rag. First things first. Clean the area. Of course you want to make sure the area is really dry before you apply your Plasti Dip. This is alcohol based cleaner so it dries very quickly. In fact, it's already dry. Then what you want to do is mask off your area. You want to mask off a decent sized area because you will get a little bit of overspray, which I found out when I was spraying the other emblem I have on my vehicle. Just tear the pieces off the size that you need, just like that. Now the little areas in between can be a tricky, but uh, just take your time, you'll get it. Here's a little tip for you, you can use a small screwdriver uh, to get your tape down in the areas you can't really get to. It's great when it works out like that. One whole piece just gets in there just right. Done it a few times so so far. Kind of getting the hang of positioning the tape, you know. <clears throat> you can always take off your emblem if you wanted. Uh, I don't have the patience for that. All right, that looks like all the spots. What we're gonna do next, is just put a little bit more around the edge just to mask it some more. What we're gonna do now is shake our Plasti Dip Can. The instructions say to shake well for one whole minute. It says hold, hold can. 12 to 15 inches away from the surface. Just kind of go gauge that by, by eye. Don't want to do when it's real windy. 
when it's in direct sunlight, it's in the shade here, so I'm okay. Let's go back and forth over it a couple of times, see how it looks. dry a minute and put a little bit more on. A little bit dry now. Another spray or so. I, uh, I think that should be good. Now we'll let it dry a little bit and remove the tape. After quite a while of drying, you can go ahead and remove your tape. Now a tip for everybody watching, um, if you put your tape on at the perimeter first, then your next piece, and then your next piece going inwards, then when you go to take the tape off, it'll all come off you know, mostly in one piece. And you don't have to sit here and pull off each individual piece like I'm doing here. Take a little bit of caution when you're getting towards the center here to peel the tape off. Now if you let it dry for like four plus hours, uh, you should be fine, but uh, I didn't let it dry quite that long. You got to take a little bit of caution. You can use that same tool we used to stick the tape in to help you get it out. <clears throat> I'm going to dry a little bit longer before I take the center pieces out. But uh, that should uh, give you an idea of how to plasti dip your emblems on your vehicle without having to take the emblems off. Thanks for watching.